Well, that return to quote unquote normalcy during a pandemic seems to be as elusive as Boise State, Boise State running back George Alani. Just when we think we're there, he's not. And add to that the seemingly endlessly moving end zone. We were supposed to be ready to fill Albertson Stadium to the brim this fall with tens of thousands of fans cheering on the Broncos. Six home games, six sellouts, according to the athletic director. And that could still be the case, but it won't be like normal. Because today, the school announced, effective tomorrow, facial coverings must be worn in public spaces indoors and crowded spaces outdoors. That goes for all on-campus and off-campus places owned and operated by Boise State University. All because of the rampant COVID Delta variant, with the CDC projecting it could cause twice as many infections as, well, the previous versions. And we're seeing increasing number of breakthrough cases as well. And this isn't just Boise State making this rule. After consulting with the State Board of Education, all four, or excuse me, all four-year public universities decided to do the same thing. It's not four of them, just three, BSU, U of I, and ISU. Now, this obviously applies to Albertson Stadium because with 36,387 people in one place, well, that seems to fall under the crowded outdoor spaces category. And after making it through a truncated season like the last one, Athletic Director Jeremiah Dickey was not too worried about this new development. We will be prepared for whatever guidelines and parameters are established by the appropriate health authorities for all home events, he said. So yes, mask, mask mandates, masks will be mandatory for fans at Bronco football games, beginning with that home opener on September 10th.